Hey guys, the Velociraptor here, because why not? And welcome to the, uh, awesome, just absolute, breathtakingly awesome, like, ARC mod thingy, the Play as the Dinosaur mod, which is, oh my goodness. Look at it, just look at it. We are the Raptor, and just words cannot explain how amazing this mod is. I believe in uh, our very first ever, uh, what's called, ARC modded adventures, I said we were gonna pretty much, uh, what's it called, like, branch off on, like, mods that are really awesome and, like, maybe do, like, little series on them, and I didn't even attack a single thing with this guy yet, and I already know I want to do so much awesome stuff with this mod, because it's just so cool. Like, look, there's a little dodo. Yeah. Yes! Delicious. And look at this. We actually have the meat in our inventory, and I believe we remote use it on ourselves? Yeah. And then we basically, we spit out the hide, and we can't craft anything, because that'd be pretty weird. I mean, we're a clever girl, but not that clever, so I, I could just already see, like, kind of the ecosystem forming as it is in the form of, like, see how, like, you're a Dilo or whatever? See how, like, they couldn't beat me in a fight if they tried, but, for example, I think I just scared them off, so they pretty much, uh, what's it called? They, they pretty much scavenge and all that, so, oh my god, it's just so awesome. So let's just eat some of this meat, let's just get it in our inventory, spit out the hide, and I believe when we level up and all that, we can actually upgrade ourselves and become like higher health and all that stuff and oh my god it's amazing and they have so many different options of like you know different things that you could do you could be like raptor dodo like you could be uh dimorphodon you can even be the bosses for crying out loud like if you want to run around being the dragon just eating everything like picking up gigas and eating them like they're nothing yeah you can do that and we also have a a new little option right here in the menu thing like you see we got we got resume menu options but now we have changed dino which kicks survival survivor uh, survivor profile out of the little box here, but yeah, that's actually how like say you just installed the mod But you're like, you know, you're a human to start off with and all that Well, uh, what's it called like? Oh, no, how do I start the mod thing? Well, what you do is you basically just click that it kills your guy. I think it deletes it I don't really know though, but what what the heck? Just leaped off there. Let's, let's hunt that guy. Where'd he go? Oh, he's in the water Oh, but look at this majestic picture-perfect area. Oh, such a perfect area to be a raptor in all that stuff. Yeah, so I'm guessing, yeah, we do need to remote use item on ourselves to eat. But, yeah, like, you press that button, and then you basically go into, like, the survive, Survivor uh, Creator thing, and you can choose, like, a whole bunch of awesome different options, which, if we die, I think we'll go and check that stuff out. So, yeah, that could be pretty cool. Like, you can, I think you can change the color. I mean, I wasn't really able to, you know, do that, so we're kind of stuck with this orange, but, I mean, it looks pretty cool, so... There you go, but you can also choose to play as, like, Skeletal for some of them, a, a baby, and all that really awesome stuff. I mean, I don't know how long you'd make it as a baby, but whatever, and look at all this. It's just, like, so many dead parasaurs. I mean, like, if I was a scavenger, this would be picture perfect, but I'm a hunter. That's what I want to do. I want to hunt. So what we're going to do is we're going to see about actually, you know, going through and doing that. Now, can we take down this galley? Let's take it out. All right, the hunt begins. Alright, got him caught on a rock, and, oh my god, this is just too amazing, whoa, jeez, what happened to him? Oh god, it's like the rock just, like, took his head, he's like, this is mine. Yeah, I'm gonna take a little bit of meat, you can have the rest, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go down this way and, uh, see what else we have, uh, cooking for us. I wanna go near that suko over there and see if it actually maybe attacks us. Hmm, because right, these guys, normally, like, if we're a, a person, they'd go after us. But because we're a raptor, they don't. Let's see, would you go after me? You wouldn't. Or would you? Well, I mean, if I attack him, obviously he will get pretty angry, but... No. Alright, so, I mean, either maybe it's uh, just a little bit weird because, you know, first time installing it and all that stuff. Or maybe they just have it where the, uh, the carnivores don't really go after you and all that stuff. I mean... I hope they, like, actually do, because that'd be, that'd be pretty awesome, running from, like, a Rex or something like that. Instead of, like, initiating the fight and, and then running. Alright. Let's actually go near these guys. Yeah, no, these guys, they... Oh, of course. Of course. Bees will forever be the one thing that tries to kill me forever. Get out of here. Oh, God. Eh. Eh, get out of here, bees. Oh, God. No matter what you do, a bee will always try to murder you. It's horrible. Oh, God. We're actually almost dead, too. Wow. All right, you know what? I'm thinking, let's actually go near this Carno here. Is he going to try to attack us? I mean, I'm, being, I'm just like, hey, how's it going? 
No, he's just kind of doing his thing. Actually, let's check the options and see if maybe they have like a new thing here. Hmm. No, they don't. All right. I thought they had like maybe like in the options because I mean if they can edit the menu thing, they can maybe edit in like like you have a roar button or something like that. I like, maybe. Wait, is he following me now? Hmm. I'm doing the follow me command. Doesn't seem to be working. Maybe. No. All right. Well, I'm guessing this is just a whole bunch of like random like not hidden controls, but you know stuff that I don't really know too much. I mean, all I really looked into was what's it called? Like how to actually turn into the dino, and that's about it. And oh god, that little uh, copy apparently just lagged everything as he's just torn apart and more galleys are coming in. Wait, can we attack our own kind? We can. Alright. So you're not like limited to like... Oh, oh god. Alright, get back here. I ain't done with you. Oh, well, he's done with me and... Oh, I fell on the ground. I can access... Alright, I'm gonna just take this, I guess. Alright, this is getting a little weird now. Alright, so I'm gonna assume I'm in like kind of ghost mode right now because pretty much like the only way they have it where you actually are able to become the dino is to, uh, what's it called? Pretty much, like, you go into it, or, it's, I don't know, it's weird, but, alright. So, yeah, I'm pretty much immortal now, so what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna click change dino, creating yada yada. Alright, that'll kill me. I died instantly to the bees. Oh, great. Alright, and once this loads up, um, create new survivor slash dino. See, we got our default kind of thing, but we, in the top right, enable play as dino, and then we have all this list of awesome stuff. We have bosses, herbivores, carnivores, mammals, flying, swimming. Like, we could be a little trilobite. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, I'd love to be a mosasaur. That'd be pretty cool. Ooh. But you know what? I think it would be pretty criminal if we didn't play as Rex. All right, it should be selected. I mean, I think right here in the middle, like in the blackness right there, it should show the dino, but... Uh, hmm. Maybe it's just not showing up for me or something like that. I don't know. Whatever. All right, so what we're going to do is we can actually name our dino, too. So... Let's name him, uh, huh, you know what, Bruce, there we go, and I think we're spawning in the middle, alright, ooh, we're albino, alright, how awesome is that, can we do the roar, that's, that's my real question, we can, yes, alright, now I am the dominant creature in this area, instead of I'm riding one, oh, that's awesome. All right, let's check our stats. So, like, we got anything good? Yeah, we got, like, a default level 1 Rex. Awesome. All right, let's just quickly traverse this, uh, this water over here and just see what's going down. And Oh, wow, we actually have to swim here. What do you know? Huh. Wait, is that what I think it is? Let me just see that. Yeah, so they did really add, like, fish sizes. Oh, that's awesome. All right, so I can see, like, a Spino being pretty much at peace over here. But no, we're going to go a little bit more inland so we can hunt some stuff that is, uh, you know, not, you know, too much, like, just all, like, scales and all that. Wait, will you go after me? No. But I can easily kill this guy like it's nothing. Yeah. And dead. Oh my god, this is, like, satisfying everything I've ever wanted from this game in the form of, like, dinosaur-wise. Like, oh my god. It's so amazing. And there we go. You can actually eat the raw prime meat. And I think it actually, like, benefits us a little bit more. I mean, I don't see us being able to, like, cook it or anything. So there you go. But how awesome is that? We're an albino rex. Oh, it's great. All right, just kind of chilling, walking on through, just being a rex. Oh, we actually leveled up. Wait, we did we level up? Hmm. Alright, I'm gonna assume that my character leveled up, not, you know, Bruce right here. So, alright. So apparently still have some character level ups, but you know what? Whatever, that shouldn't matter too much. And I actually, I think I just stepped on that monkey, so we'll just let him be and... <gasps> Spino. Spino v. Rex fight. And I am the Rex. Yes. Alright, let's grab a little bit of meat by killing this guy right here. There we go. Delicious. Taking down trees and all that. Alright, we'll get rid of that hide. Just spit that out. Alright, let's get some stamina real quick. Just so we can actually, uh... 
you know, see what we're doing, and we heal pretty fast, which is awesome. So we'll get full health, full stamina, and there we go. We'll, we, we should be able to get it by the time we get over to that uh, Spina. And then, there we go. Rex v. Spino fight. Yes. All right. So looking around this area, this area looks awesome. We got, like, the blood salmon or whatever they are. We got those li little guys that you can pet and all that. Got, like, a uh, Carno fighting a trike over there. A nice... Nice little ecosystem. Awesome. Alright. Oh, and it's raining to make it more badass. Oh, this is too perfect. Alright, we're gonna do a badass victory screech, like, staring him dead in the face. And then... Alright. There we go. Alright. Yeah. Now, we see who's king. The level one Rex or this unknown level Spino. Yes. I... Obviously, Rex, there we go. Where are you running to, my friend? Yeah. Level 13 Spino. Wait, hold on. Did I just... Oh, he just, like, kicked his foot up. Like, yeah, I'm a dancer. No, but, like, when I roared, did I just, like, hurt him, actually? No, because it sounded like a blood spatter when I actually did that. It's pretty weird. But, yeah, all right, now we can level ourselves up. Let's see how this works. All right, Cool. So, we don't gain too much health each level up, but, I mean, we are straight up T-Rex, so that shouldn't be too much of a problem. And I think, or at least I hope, there's no level cap. We can just kind of keep going. So, we can actually just become like a god-tier Rex, maybe even be the Rex that, like, uses our little nubby hands and all that and collects all the artifacts and solo fights the dragon or something awesome like that. Right, I just stepped on a monkey. I'm sorry, little monkey. Alright, you know what? Let's go maybe, uh... Actually, no, let's go inland. Like, let's actually follow the river up this way, and... Oh, it's a Stego. You can also be that little Dimorphodon guy, which is pretty cool. Can we actually pick him out of the sky? No, we can't. Hmm. Alright, so I'm guessing how we heal is... We don't eat over time. It's more of a... We actually have to feed ourselves, so... A little bit of a drawback, but you know what? I'll take it. If that's, like, the only, like, bad thing that happens... I'll take that. All right. Eat this packy like he's nothing. Delicious. All right. Now we'll go after this little Stego here. Hey, Stego. Oh, God. There's a little grouping up there. Oh, my God. He just... I think he just killed all of them. Just, like, whacked them with his tail. Jeez. Oh, we're, like, stun-locking him now. All right. We almost got him. Oh, we almost actually got the... The Pterodactyl, too. All right. Are those bees actually attacking me? They're actually going for me, I think. Wait, no, they're not. Either way, they need to die. All right, let's go after the Carno there. Get some sweet, sweet XP so we can actually level up and, you know, do some stuff like that. I mean, we can also attack these guys in the water here, but... Nah, I'm okay. All right, yeah. All right, actually, someone who can fight back and not, like, have me just stunlock them. Yes. Back you up into a rock. Crunch of dead. Yes. Alright, now let's uh, start to get rid of some of this stuff. Let's treat ourselves, I guess, with a, a little bit of prime meat. There we go. Delicious. Alright. And we're actually entering somewhat of our first night as well, which is, uh... It's gonna be kind of scary. Uh, I really don't know what could kill us as a Rex besides, like... You know, a grouping of, like, small, semi-powerful stuff, or... Maybe the, uh, what's it called? The big bad Brontos over there, which I'm thinking maybe we should just go try that out so we can go see what, like, maybe being a herbivore is like and all that stuff. You know what? I'm thinking we'll do that. We can play as, like, a, uh, a Rex some other time or something like that, but we have some pterodactyls actually caught in trees here. I mean, a rock. Alright, we got them. Actually killed a pterodactyl. Wow, level 31. Jeez. All right, it's starting to get a tad bit dark here. I mean, if it gets too dark, I'll do my uh, little cheating powers of turning it into day and all that. And oh, we're actually getting attacked by a little raptor here. Die, you! Yeah. All right, there we go. Let's level up and let's see how much our melee actually goes up by. One percent. Hmm. All right, I'm guessing that's to make it where you're not like too overpowered, and then it's just like, eh, I already beat it, kind of thing. Alright, I see a galley. We got 
Lots of galleys. I'm loving how like the galleys are just kind of all over and all that stuff. And yeah, I think we do take fall damage. So that's something we have to be aware of. Alright, so we get a Bronto over here. Now, I, all right, that's pretty cool. We still like default, like actually defecate. So it's not like, oh, you you died because you were too constipated or something like that. I don't know. But, alright. Hello, Brontos. Alright, it's actually kind of dark in there. Alright, thank you for destroying the tree so we can see everything. There we go. Yeah. Alright, let's see if we can take this guy down. Guys. Alright, there's two of them. Well, obviously, but you know what I mean. Oh, they have me stunlocked on a rock. Alright, they're just using their tremendous tail to just whack me around like I'm a, a game of Pong or something. Oh, God. Oh, did he just, like, knock me off? Like, I took fall damage even? Oh, God. Alright, I'm not really the best with turning. Oh, God. Alright. Oh, they are just relentlessly just assaulting me with their tail. Look at these, this blood. Oh, God. I mean, it's a little bit dark, but... You know what? Th there's nothing we can do about it right now. Oh, they're mate boosted, too. Why did I think this was a good idea? Oh, God. Alright, this is the fall of the Rex. No! And dead. Alright, down goes Bruce. Oh no. Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna take that hide from you there, buddy. Alright, so what we're gonna do is let me just quickly set time of day 12 o'clock. There we go, just so we can actually see everything. And we're gonna change our dino. And I'm thinking we'll either play as like a a flying dino or maybe like a herbivore of some kind. I mean that could be pretty cool. Alright, let's see. Oh no, you know what? Let's go into the ocean. The ocean in the east. Yeah, east. Alright, create new dino thing. Enable play as dino. And because I have actually, in my all my time of this game, I've never seen a Moza. I've never seen a Mosasaur. Wait, what did that say? Press N to turn into the dino. Oh. Alright. Actually, wait, I like that name right there. Big Joe. We'll just add the word big. Alright, now we're gonna go into Ocean East. Alright, actually, that's kind of like the middle of the whole everything. Let's actually spawn in the east zone. Yeah, there. There we go. And create. Alright, end to start playing. Come to think of that, I think that's what it means when, like, you see how we, like, died as the Rex and the Raptor and all that? I think when you press N, you turn into them in the form of, like, pretty much like you die and you can just respawn right there on the spot. Keep your levels and all that. Hey, Megalodon. How's it going? Oh my god. Oh, I've never in, like, my entire, like, time of playing this game, I've seen, like, only a few Mosasaurs, but I've never, you know, fully seen one. This is, this is insane. And the first time I actually do end up seeing it, I am it. Oh my god, this thing's huge. This thing's, this thing's a monster. What even is this thing? Oh my god, I love it. Alright, look at all that fish meat. Yes. Alright, let's go to the surface and see what coloring we have. Oh, we have like a nice gray, uh, not gray, green sail and a gray everything else. Alright, can we beach ourselves? That's what I want to test out, but oh my god, like we're the size of just everything. Actually, no, we have a little bit of a uh, bit of blue in us. Alright, cool. Alright, but what I do want to try is to get off that rock, but I want to try this. All right, turn around and yeah. All right, getting a galley. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Apparently, I killed a trilobite. There we go. Who said mosasaurs can't eat some uh, some dino meat every once in a while? Oh, that's awesome. All right. All right actually, wait. I want to get a good look at his face and all that, and maybe see if we can maybe get another parasaur or something. All right, swim up here. Alright, he doesn't really want to look at me, so you know what? Never mind. Alright, let's go into the the deep, deep depths of the ocean, because we own this place. This is my land. Alright, what's that over there? Is that a little megalodon? Is, is it going to go for me? I think it does. Yeah, because megalodons, just, they attack everything, so it really makes it where, like, if you're going to be uh, in the ocean, it's just like a deadly, deadly, deadly place. Awesome. Oh my god, this is, this is amazing. I'm loving the Mosasaur. We can even, like, explore kind of, like, the very bottom and, like, all the deep, deep, dark, dark depths and all that. We can even look up and 
see if there's something like above us or oh my god it's amazing can we break that no i think a dunkleosius could actually break that though go go mining i i am the dino and i'm gonna go out to my daily job of mining oil is this the world border or am i stuck on something yep that is the world border all right all right sorry for the quick little uh what's it called jump cut thing right there but i completely forgot that we have the dragon as an option to uh you know check out i i just i couldn't leave this guy out of our awesome dino mod like you could play as them thing like i mean come on look at this thing it's amazing like we got fire breath we got bite and i mean my head's bigger than most of the flipping dinos for crying out loud we can sprint on all fours and i just killed a copy or two oh god but look we got a little uh diplodocus right there all right there we go that's some good meat right there actually it's taking a beating jeez Oh, here's some fire breath. Actually, no, we need some stamina, and good thing we have 400 stamina and all this health, and oh my god. Burn. Yes. Something's actually attacking me. What's going on? I think it's actually... Wow. This guy refuses to die. Huh. Whoa. Wait. Oh, there's a... There's a, there's a Bigfoot right there. Alright. You get out of here, you. Okay. There we go. Yes. All right, and we can also, we can fly. We can't fly very fast, I think. Like, I'm pressing shift to uh, try to speed up, but it's not really doing much for us, but I mean, just look at this thing. Wingspan of a canyon. I mean, oh my God, this thing's too amazing for words and, oh God. All right, so we're gonna go just, you know, casually fly over all the land. And actually, no, let's, let's rest for a little bit. And what we need to do is get a little bit of stamina, which I don't think we're too good in the stamina. Actually, no, never mind. We actually are. Uh, yeah, so damage, I mean, yeah, we don't get anything from that. It's just more beneficial to get health, I guess, because we get 800 each level up. So there you go. Oh, my God. Just fire breath, just destroying entire valleys worth of dinos. Oh, my God. This is just, it's just too good. All right. There we go, we'll just do that right there. And, yeah, basically you're the dragon, you beat the game kind of thing. Hey look, it's some Brontos. I love being bigger than both of them collectively. All right, let's just go in for a nice landing right here. I mean, look at this. Look at you guys, how's it going? Die, yes, and fire breath. Come on, we gotta get some stamina just so we can, uh fire breath there we go yes all right we can we can keep biting even when we're like practically out of stam stamina so that's pretty nice look at that we got terror birds I haven't seen them in forever actually attacking the parasaur and it looks like I'm like a sort of like a weather balloon looking down like oh look at that we got we can see them from above but no I'm like right next to them eating them like it's nothing there's a parasaur dead right, there's something in these tree line I think oh there he is Oh my god. Oh, look at that group of turtles. They're so cute and... The, oh my god, my hand is just bigger than like a Rex. I think. Oh my god. Alright. Oh, they're dead. Oh, he's dead. Alright, you know what? I, I feel like we've, we, we've done it. We've beaten the everything. And Oh my god, it's just insane. I love it. This mod is just... There is no downside to this mod is all I can say. And, Actually, wait, let's check our... Yeah, we actually gained quite a bit of stamina, too, when we level up. So, yeah, anyhow, I think right here's a good spot to end it for now. Next time, we're going to be checking out a, another mod of some kind and all that stuff. And I, I did say we were going to maybe, like, continue this mod and all that. And, I mean, we can't not. It's just it's just too awesome of a mod to not. So, yeah, I guess let me know uh, what dino we should maybe start with or do some stuff like that. And what we should, like, overall do with the mod and all that when we actually uh, get that series up and running and all that fun stuff but yeah so also also let me know uh, what mod we should do like next time for like the next like mod adventure or something like that so yeah like the video if you enjoyed subscribe for more and i will see you next time